Hello and welcome to the Cleaning and Contamination Defect Guide. My name is Bob Willis and these videos are designed to complement the printed version of the Defect Guide. You can download a copy of this guide from the Global SMT website. The defect we want to discuss now is solder finish damage. Now solder finishes, that's the gold, the silver, the tin, the OSP coatings can be damaged by a cleaning process or certainly the solderability can be reduced. One of the key things to consider when you're considering what type of surface finish to specify on printed circuit boards is what you're going to do to them. If you're going to wipe off or wash off boards partway through manufacture because you're unhappy with the quality of the solder paste printing, you need a, a chemical and a finish to be compatible. Otherwise you'll have poor wettability and so poor solderability or certainly wicking as a process defect during soldering. Now not all finishes are created equal and not all cleaning processes are created equal. So first of all you need to establish the right combination. It's fair to say that generally speaking a solder coated board or a gold finish board are probably the most robust but if they're poorly cleaned they'll still leave some form of surface residue and when you apply paste then apply components and reflow unfortunately you may not get a, a true interconnection and where you see solder tending to wet to the component lead rather than the PCB it's not necessarily a PCB problem it may be something that you've created yourself